Hello bros, I have made a list for tutorials you said me to make. So, I have already done how to use speech recognition without any grammar file. Okay, I have done it in a video previously. And now I will show you how to write any application with speech recognition in Java. Well, I will show you right now. So, I have created a simple application in JavaFX, which we will see now. Let's run it. A very simple one. And you can download the code from the GitHub. Here it is, the user interface. Just a second to open the browser. Here we are on the GitHub. This computer gave me cancer. It is so slow. It is a cancer. And uh, here on the new specific tutorial for JavaFX, it is the code for this tutorial. Okay, my dear friends. Okay, I have downloaded it and uh, I will show you how it runs. So, start. It is using a grammar, by the way. I have shown you how to use a whole dictionary in another video I have released. So, let's see the grammar. What day is today? What day is today? Hmm. Say hello. Who is your daddy? Hey, boss. No, it is good. It is... Um, okay. Look something other. Sphinx 4 by default has not the ability to pause and resume. resume. So, if you want to pause it, I have created something special in the code right here. I have created a boolean variable, so when it is true, it ignores the result what that means it, if we have a method that uh, here it is uh, make a decision which accepts what the speech recognition has as result for example it has as result say hello it accepts it if the boolean is of ignore results is true it doesn't enter that method that's it simple huh okay so if I click now pause, look, ignoring speech, results, nothing. If I click resume, it provides again results. It says uh, what the fuck it wants, because it is not accurate as always. What day is today? Who is your daddy? Okay. It works when it wants. Okay, so that's functionality, start, pause, resume. If you stop it, you can stop it. Okay, you must exceed the application. So you can pause it and resume it once you have started it. Okay, bros. So now I will explain you the user interface. So I'm using a main class here for the JavaFX. I will make tutorials about this, how to make a simple application in JavaFX in the next videos. I have that in list also to do, so I will show you generally the classes. Here I'm starting the application. Here it is the interface where it has the uh, three buttons. And here it is the rewrite and code for speech recognition. Well, you said me what if I want to use whole dictionary. Okay, you uncomment it and you comment this and you use whole dictionary and it is 0% accurate thanks for watching bros the code is on github and i see you all very soon